Okay, we're about to uh, test drive Mitsubishi's first uh, plug-in hybrid. Um, as uh, demonstrated in a current body uh, Outlander. And we're now here with uh, Mitsubishi Motors Philippines, uh, Froyland Dichan King, the Vice President for Marketing Services, who will tell us about um, about this uh, latest innovation for Mitsubishi. Okay, yes, as, as you mentioned, Verna, no, uh, this is the uh, prototype, the first running prototype of the Mitsubishi's plug-in hybrid electric vehicle. And after uh, launching the uh, full electric vehicle in uh, 2009, uh, this is uh, actually the, the next project of uh, Mitsubishi to roll out the uh, plug-in hybrid electric vehicle, which will eventually extend the uh, range of these uh, electric vehicles no? from, uh, from city use. It can now be uh, driven uh, in, uh, in the countryside or uh, in the provinces. And uh, actually, as explained earlier by the uh, engineers, uh, this will eventually be the uh, uh, system will be carried over to the next series, next generation uh, of cars, which will be rolled out by uh, Mitsubishi Motors in two to three years' time. And uh, eventually, this these cars uh, or this plug-in hybrid electric vehicles, as seen in the latest uh, 42nd Tokyo Motor Show, uh, will now be the uh, trend in all the uh, automotive industry. Okay. So, when, when can when can Filipino Mitsubishi buyers expect a a plug-in hybrid or a, or an electric vehicle? Well, well, for the electric vehicle, we're we're planning to. Uh, bring in the uh, sample units uh, next year actually 2012 yes 2012 and that's the i mean and uh, basically we're now working with the uh, government and uh, a uh, power corporation uh, meralco on how to eventually make this uh, electric vehicles viable in the philippine road use and uh, of course this plug-in hybrid electric vehicle as uh, earlier mentioned and also sh uh, shown in the Tokyo Motor Show, it will be uh, rolled out in the uh, next, probably the next SUV, that which, that which will be launched by MMC, by uh, again, two to three years from now. Okay, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Okay. This vehicle has a um, conventional 2-liter uh, straight 4 gasoline engine under the hood and an electric motor in front and another electric motor uh, at the back. The battery pack uh, is uh, situated um, under the vehicle. So then can you shift D yeah, yeah, and okay. leave us and neutral have a little bit of uh, time lag, so then yeah. push B. So and if you want to uh, stop, so then press P button. P? P. Okay. No problem. Yeah? Okay? Yeah. So what, what we're testing now is actually... Um, the plug-in hybrid technology of Mitsubishi. Not really the car. It's, this, this car is just a um, demonstration vehicle. Mm -hmm. uh, but, but what we're trying to see now is uh, um, the power, the power delivery, the performance, the, the reliability of um, the seamlessness mm -hmm. of uh, Mitsubishi's first ever plug-in uh, uh, hybrid technology. As you can see, um, the shifter, the shift up of uh, of this technology is kind of similar to uh, what you find inside the Toyota Prius, right? Mm -hmm. So anyway, let's put it in B. So are we ready to go? Go ahead. 
Okay. What mode are we in now? Normal? Now. Now, normal mode okay. and uh, uh, normal drive mode. Okay. So, now start uh, EV mode. Okay. So, if you want to start the engine, so meaning, so, press, acceleration over one half or over, so the engine is automatically started. Okay. Yeah. But right now, we're still in, uh, in EV mode, right? Yeah. Over the uh, 18, so then uh, more outside, meaning so uh, lane 3. So only up to 80, right? Mm -hmm. Only up to 80 kilometers per hour? Or speed speed limit? Ah, no, 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 120 km. Okay. So now it just start. Okay, so about 100 kilometers per hour, the engine, the gasoline engine kicks in. Uh, now drive generator, so over 120 kilometers, so then uh, engine drive directly uh, wheel. Mm Parallel mode. Press the park, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Is that okay? Spark? Yes, yeah, spark. Great. Thank okay. you. Okay. Nice car. Here's our famous controversial uh, style guru, Ryan Afong. Father, what can you say about uh, Mitsubishi's first plug-in hybrid uh, technology? Um, seamless yung integration one. The uh, engine with the uh, electric power plant. Pag, uh, I think pag 100 in uh, normal mode, uh, engine kicks in. Uh, you can hear it kick in, but no jerking, wala nga lang. So that way is smooth talaga. Tapos sa uh, pag in power mode naman, uh, it kicks in earlier, tsaka pag, na, pag uh, full throttle. Uh, so, medyo merong ano, merong, you can feel yung surge ng acceleration, but nothing uh, really uh, jerky. So, do, do you think uh, this is almost uh, production ready? Uh, not, not exactly. Um, I think meron pa silang Siguro, transmission. Maybe they can take the real duration, but it's too high. I think it's too high towards the efficiency. Okay, thank you. This is Russell Roll, uh, the handsome PR guy of Mitsubishi Motors. Russell, can you tell us about um, the timetable for this uh, plug-in hybrid technology? Uh, when When is Mitsubishi planning on uh, rolling this out? To, uh, the global market. Sure. Uh, this vehicle that will uh, that we have now, it's it's really this vehicle that you can see behind me is actually just an Outlander with the system in it. But the actual uh, 
the actual new car with the with everything all, all together will come out sometime in uh, fiscal year 2012. That's the Japanese fiscal year. So that means uh, somewhere between uh, now and uh, April of, well, hold on, April of 2013, before April, April 2013. It should be out in the market by then? Yes, fi okay. during the, that 2012 fiscal year. Okay, thank you. Yamada-san, I understand that the battery pack of mm -hmm. uh, this vehicle is uh, right under, under yes. uh, the car itself, right? Mm -hmm. What happens when there's a flood, flood water? Flood water. So our uh, no, vehicle, uh, especially battery, was all uh, operation uh, no, is, uh, very uh, no, strictly shielded. So if uh, no, some uh, flood, flood area, no problem. So it can it can go through uh, flood water safely. Yes, yes. basically, okay. uh, no, completely sealed, no problem about that. It's the, the battery pack. You're saying that the battery pack is sealed, yes, right? Yes, battery pack and the motors. Okay. okay, so it's perfect for the Philippines. Yes, perfect for Philippines. Okay, thank you. Welcome.